In today's video, we are going to take a look at one of the most broken build featuring 6 Noxus and 5 Shurima, with the major focus being the 3-star Shurima Darius. The items required for Darius will be the Shurima Emblem, the Infinity Edge, and the Hand of Justice. This comp is tough to build, but once you make it, it's going to outshine the opponent teams, while other players are busy playing the new meta comps and contesting each other. Winning is simple with this build. It's gonna be like you're on a roller coaster watching this gameplay. So, without further ado let's jump straight into it. I chose Earth as my main legend in this game, so that I can obtain one Noxus and one Shurima emblem. In this game, I got the Bandle Cafeteria Portal, which is one of the best for this build as it provides us with a spatula, and also guarantees us one of the required Shurima or Noxus emblems. The first augment I chose was Ancient Archives, which will provide a Tome of Traits. From Tome of Traits, I have to choose one emblem out of four. Unfortunately, I didn't obtain the emblems I needed. Therefore, I selected the more suitable option based on the available choices, which is the Invoker, as I'll be using Cassiopeia. At stage 2 to 5, I constructed the Shurima emblem by combining a spatula and a needlessly large rod. The second augment I chose was the Shurima crest as that was the only viable option there. As the match progressed, I made a build of 7 Shurima that helped me secure a winning streak. I almost lost hope of getting the Noxus emblem, but my third augment comes as Salvage Bin Plus, which provides a random completed item now, and a component after 4 player combats. And I can break a complete item of the champion holding it by selling the champion. I sold my champion holding the emblems and made a new Shurima and a Noxus emblem. Then I stayed at level 7 in search of more Darius and Katarina copies. After finding out, I might be fighting one of the most powerful guy in the match, I leveled up to level 8 so that I wouldn't lose my win streak. As the game was progressing, I kept on getting one by one Darius and Katarina copies, and at the same time, I kept my win streak on, which provided me extra golds to reroll. At stage 6 to 1, I 3 star my Darius and Katarina at the same time, which has been the most satisfying thing to watch. Just watch Darius destroy the enemy board. Darius also takes Titan's Resolve and Bloodthirster as alternative items. And instead of the Invoker Emblem, there is an option for the Slayer Emblem on Katarina along with Ionic Spark. The rest of the build remains the same. As always, thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys again with exciting and fun TFT videos. Stay tuned for more exciting content. Remember to subscribe to stay up to date with our latest videos on our channel, Item Swap.